We're back again with Rolling with Stone as the road trip continues for this Texas Tech soccer program as they wrap up the non-conference season with the Jack in the Box Classic in Albuquerque against UC Davis on Friday, UC Santa Barbara on Sunday. Coach, you guys have won four straight. You'll wrap up the non-conference season this weekend. How big is it to get a little momentum as you head into the Big 12 play? Well, you know, as you heard me say many times, Rowie, the college soccer season is just so short. 19 games. I don't think there's ever a time when you don't feel like the game's big. Four in a row is great, but I think most importantly is we've played better each game since we took the loss to Long Beach. It was a good wake-up call for us. I think we learned a lot from it, and uh, as I said, I think we've improved each game since that time. To exactly no one's surprise, Victoria S. and Janine Becky having phenomenal seasons, rewarded so by the Big 12 Conference this week, your Big 12 Offensive and Defensive Player of the week this week. Not a big surprise to you. Well, and you know, for Vic, sometimes we just play great and she doesn't have anything to do. But in the Arizona State game, that game was dead even for most of the contest, and she made two enormous saves. You know, they just show up as two saves on the stat book, but they were two game savers. She kept a clean sheet, and that's why she got it. You know, Janine on a Sunday, everybody's tired. It's 98 degrees at kickoff. She scores two goals when no one else on the other team looked like they were gonna score. So it was the type of game where Janine just stood up like the player she is and made sure she took care of the offense for us. Big 12 Offensive Player of the Week, Defensive Player of the Week. You're ranked in the top 20 in all the major polls. Just these are the type of accolades and recognition that good programs get. How do you handle that? Does it put a target on your back? Well, I think we've had a target for the last several years as we've continued to get better. you got to bump some people out of the way and therefore you become a little bit targeted. There's still a whole other group of teams ahead of us that we're chasing and that keeps us, I think, focused because by no means are, you know, are we going to be ranked in the top five next week. So there's a, there's a big group of teams out there that are also having great seasons and we're just trying to get better every week, which I know sounds like a cliche, but I think that's how the team has stayed focused is that we're not ready for Big 12 play yet. We need another weekend. We're not ready for the big time teams in our conference yet. We need more time. So uh, these are the things that kind of keep us online and, and help us stay uh, disciplined in practice and, and striving for more. Wrapping up the non-conference season this weekend. Again, UC Davis on Friday, UC Santa Barbara, all of it from Alga, Albuquerque. Keep it posted to texastech.com for all the latest. Coach, best of luck this weekend. Thank you. Appreciate it.